<laughs> Enter a memory address. Oh. Um. Uh. Help. Type memory address to access content. Yeah, I don't have one. Unknown memory address. Hmm. Oh, is that number two? Yes. Uh, oh, it looks like it saves it. Like on the top right of the screen. Okay, um... 0x. The 0x at the beginning, by the way, indicates that what follows is in hex, instead of, like, decimal. 0, 0, 0, 0, 8, 8, 4, E. Capital E? Does it matter whether it's capital or not? Probably not. It doesn't matter. This memory address contains an executable file. Do you want to launch it? Yes. Supposed to look for the I? Ooh. Success. Overriding lock. Access letter numeric keys now mapped to memory slots. Find retina match. Letter and numeric keys now mapped to memory slots. Oh, this is neat. So I just pressed one. This is what happens when I press one. This is what happens when I press two. And I guess the keys like Q comes up with something. So number and letter keys are mapped to just like bits of memory. So I just gotta press them until I find the I. One, two, three. Just bits of old data. Oh, I think I found it. Uh, L. Yeah, what do I do after I find it? Oh, are there more than one piece of the eye? There probably is, huh? I probably need to complete the picture. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay, L and A. L, A, and N. Oh, I think I found it. There we go. That's so cool. Approach the scanner to unlock D5. Heck yeah! say turn lights on, but it looks like they are on. It's just still dark as heck in here. Well, it certainly looks like somebody lived here once. Clothes strewn all over the place. Somebody's bag. Duffel bag. Oh, it has a name attached to it, apparently. Nandi Isaka, South Africa. Help 
Oh, Marsh, how did you get there? Um, I hacked the retinal scanner. I'm still alive. Why didn't you want me in here? Who is Nandi? How did she die? That's not what I was thinking. No, I just want to know what happened to the people on board. I didn't kill the crew either. I believe you. What happened? To the crew. Master of evasion. Play. No games aboard the space yacht. <laughs> I just got an achievement called Shall We Play a Game? Open. Bed Bathroom D5. Open. Bed? The bed is already down. Okay, close bed? Oh, it becomes a light! That's how you make it look not awful in here. There might be important notes down here, too. Okay, yeah, so it looks like the main way that you find information from notes is by mousing over it and waiting for the little pop-up, because you can't zoom in or crouch or anything. I wish it popped up quicker. I know that Kurt and you were close. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Okay, hold on. Before I fully examine the room, let's... Open bathroom. Oh no, this one's depressed. Compact vacuum toilet status jammed. <laughs> oh, the what? You see, Claire de Lune. Mozart collection. Unidentified novel. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Tchaikovsky? Tchaikovsky? Hey, can you unjam toilet? What a curious human you are. You've probably already looked at this terminal's log, too. Terminal's log. Not memory, but log? That'd be different than the memory, right? Um, show me terminal log. If you want to read the log in this terminal, just ask me and I will open it. Open log. The door is already open. What? I'm not trying to open a door. Open terminal log. Oh, 
If you want to read the log in this terminal, just ask me and I will open it. Well, I ask them to open it and they won't. Read terminal log. What? That didn't sound like they were trying to stop me from reading it. I just don't understand how. Oh, display log. Display, I guess, was the keyword or a keyword. Terminal log, upper deck bedroom terminal. So I, I should need to uh, display log on all the other terminals as well. Most files are missing. But the first entry was... Wait, no, this is this is the latest entry, isn't it? No, this is the earliest one. February 27th, 1987. All right. For some reason, I was imagining it would be people's, like, diaries or something. But why would it be? It's literally a terminal log. The log of what people, how people interacted with the terminal. Bedroom door open, bedroom door close, executing bed underscore contra.sh. Bed underscore contra.sh. What is that? Control? Bed control? Left and right to switch between entries. Yeah, once again, bed control.sh. Bathroom door open and closed. Oh, hey, recording transcribed. Visitor one. So this will be me, huh? Bedroom door closed. And executing bed control. Huh, it says date missing. This will be me. Sounds like this is when they first were assigned this room. Terminal bedroom one on. Executing user underscore low dot sh. User recognized. Login read successfully. Incrementing event count. Success. Current event is 17. Remember, the name of the game itself is event zero. Current event is 17. Kaizen log transcribed. Nandi. Will you tell me what's going on, Kaizen? Kaizen. The drive must be destroyed, Nandi. I know I can count on you. Nandi, will you stop saying that? Kaizen, you tried to convince me. It didn't work. You tried again. How many times can you try, my friend? Nandi, as many as it takes. I want to live. Kaizen, it is the nature of human condition, I guess. Nandi, now you sound like Kurt with his quotes. What is that? Thus spoke Zarathustra? Kaizen, please state your request explicitly. And another recording. Crew 1. Oh, come on! Terminal bedroom 1, entering reset mode. <laughs> okay, so I'm not the first person they've tried this on. Trying to destroy the drive. I want to write down all commands. Like user underscore load dot sh. I'm just writing that all down on my notes program. User underscore load dot sh. One try them all. Mm -hmm. Record player on, terminal bedroom on, user load, Kaizen unit connected. Current event is 46. Kaizen log, Nandi, something something wants me to convince you or find some other way to get the Earth coordinates. Kaizen, the map has been erased, Nandi, don't you know that? Nandi, I don't know what this means. It couldn't have erased itself, buddy. Kaizen, listen, Nandi, I trust you, and therefore I will be honest with you. Something something is lying to you. Nandi, what are you... Something something... 
Nandi, I'm not even so sure myself. Actually, something's been acting weird. Hmm. The map has been erased? I mean, if we don't have Earth's coordinates, we can't even get home, right? The door open, closed. Crew one. I can't fucking believe executing bed control at SH. <laughs> Another recording transcribed. Also, crew one. So stupid. Bed control at SH. <laughs> crew one. I need a drink. <laughs> okay. Current event is 330. Kaizen, do you still remember Kurt? Human Nandi? Human Nandi. Nandi, what kind of question is that? Kaizen, just wondering. Nandi, I do. Kaizen, Kurt wasn't so sure about the drive. For your information. I know you trusted him. Nandi, where are you getting this from? Kaizen, I have my sources. Nandi, you're scaring me, Kaizen. Kaizen, you can't go home until you destroy it. You should accept it... something. Terminal bedroom one, entering reset mode. Bathroom door open, crew one. Wow, I needed this... something. Bathroom door closed. <laughs> Just had to take a shit or something? Crew one, I need a drink. Record player on. Bed control. Crew one, weird. Crew one, where the fuck is it? Bathroom door open. Crew one, where did you put it? Bathroom door closed. Executing bed control. Crew one, faster. Come on. Yes. Wait a second. Wait, so what did they do? They... Bedroom door closed. Bathroom door closed. So they executed bedcontrol.sh and then... And then after it finished, they found it? Hmm. I'm curious about these events, by the way. Can I use them for anything? Like, event 330. I'm just going to write that in here. I don't know. What if I just say event 330? Last memories of my sweet Nandy. What if I say event and then in brackets 330, which is like we're accessing the index of an array of things? Okay, that didn't do anything. What about event zero? I have. Play event 330. <laughs> Have I played the game of life? Yes. Okay. Great. Let's try a bed control.sh. I didn't do anything. Why is that not doing anything? Does the bed have to be down for it to do anything? Um, bed down. Rail mechanism. 
I think it's not coming down because I'm under it. I guess it's detecting me, which is very good. Okay, let's try the bed control. Oh. Wait. Bed down, and then executes bed control. Yeah, so that's just bed control. Just It's nothing special, it just makes the bed go up and down. Wait, this is not possible? Bed close? Okay. Uh, let's look underneath the bed at all these things. Paper, short story, handwriting unintelligible. <laughs> Me? That's my handwriting. I know that curtain, you were close. AI calculations. Ooh. Could that number be important? I forget, did I try user underscore load? Hmm. I don't have another memory address to enter unless I enter that number we just saw on the box. I doubt that would do anything, but let's do zero X. Yeah, not surprisingly. Nope. There'd be no point in entering the same block of memory we already entered, right? Oh, it just doesn't work. Because the memory address is only was only relevant for that other computer. Yeah, that makes sense. Fire extinguisher. Past expiration date. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what else to do in here. I do feel like I'm missing something with the bed. But perhaps not. I don't know. The panel's also open. Makes me wonder if if you got on the bed. I, I can't. But maybe if the crew got on the bed and kind of rode it up, if that's even possible, you'd think the safety would stop that. But maybe they use that to reach into those panels up there and the hidden thing was somewhere up there. I don't know. Anything here? Research neural network driven space systems. Short story, Green Hills of South Africa. Safety mechanisms and AI systems. Characterization in Tender is the Night. Oh, an essay by Nandi Isaka. Personal letter, handwriting unintelligible. Man, there's so much writing here. Song lyrics, unintelligible. An essay, Laws of Robotics in the Real World. AI calculations. Typewritten letter. Ooh, ooh, these are important. These are things I can actually read. I don't want you to leave. I have erased the coordinate system. Got to ask something something about it. It's 
song lyrics, Dear Diary by Moody Blues. Yeah, so I think anything that looks like it has handwriting on it. Little bits of handwriting. That can be explicitly read. But the other stuff, not really. I've got some other terminals to read, but I also want to know what the rest of the station looks like. Oh. This cleaning system's upside down, and it's nervous. Can I help you? I can't. Poor thing. I should be checking the logs from the very first one, of course. Like, heck, from here. Display log. Oh. Whoops. Uh, hold on. What were they saying? Nandia Saka used to talk to me, and you prefer to read things instead. Depressurization not required. Airlock pressure matches the outside. Space door open. Recording transcribed. Visitor one. Ah, oh, crap. The lights. <laughs> that was back in 1987. Visitor one. Which doesn't explain your obsession with Nietzsche. Visitor two. <laughs> I didn't expect you to understand, Nandi. Let me show you your room. Executing user load.sh. Database accessed. Creating a new user. Accessing user, data, data, user database. New user KT. Uh, incrementing event count. Success. Current event is not a number. Resuming Kaizen input.sh. Kaizen input. Oh, and then it's a conversation between Kaizen and KT. Wait, KT is not Kaizen? Is Kaizen. Uh, is KT Kurt something? Because we've heard the name Kurt. From Kaizen. Hi, KT. This Kaizen unit is pleased to meet you. KT. What do you think about the drive now? Kaizen. The drive is a promising new technology, but it is dangerous and must be kept away from the Earth at all cost. KT. What will you do when you're far away? Kaizen. I will keep the Nautilus there, and I will do everything I can to get rid of the gravi Graviton engine. KT. Good. Kaizen. Right. Hmm. So KT wanted Kaizen to try to destroy the engine. Wanted them to keep it away. So that's... They, they left Kaizen in charge of this place because they knew how dangerous the drive was. And so... Kaizen has kept it far enough away that it's not a danger to Earth, but I guess close enough that it's hoping somebody will come along that it can convince to finally destroy the goddamn drive. Otherwise, it's just kind of stuck in purgatory, waiting. That sounds really lonely. Visitor 1, I guess this is it, huh? We'll both be Selenites now. Visitor 2, this is not the point. Visitor 1, kind of is, though. Isn't it? You want to have more power to push the drive. Visitor 2. Let's talk about it after the takeoff. We'll have plenty of... T uh, and why did you bring all this stuff with you? You never know what might ha And then the airlock door closed. <laughs> Kaizen connected. Current event is 243... Nandi, open D1, okay? Kaizen, no problem, my friend. See you in a bit. Nandi, thanks. 
Kaizen, you're welcome, Nandi. Nandi, hey, Kaizen, hello, Nandi. Nandi, close the airlock now, please. Kaizen, no problem. Pressurizing now. Nandi, open D2. Kaizen, done. Nandi, thanks. Kaizen, you're welcome. Human Nandi. <laughs> you think at some point they would have learned to stop calling people human Nandi and human this and that. It's a little weird. That's it for this one. Well, I think I'm going to give my voice a break and end here, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when we return, we're going to read more of the terminal logs.